Hi everyone, this is Moo, and I'm sitting here with somebody I hadn't seen for about 25 years until last night, and that's my cousin Shane Gurrell. This is Shane. He's also known as Shane Eat Raw on Facebook, and I'll let him give you his YouTube and other information. Shane is on, has about a little bit over halfway on a, a journey from um, he's riding his bike from Longview, Washington to Sedona, Arizona, and he's about halfway, and we're sitting in the Inventura in the Dollhouse Zen Garden right now, and I'm going to um, just let Shane tell you a little bit about his story and what inspired him to take this journey and uh, what's happening right now, and I might ask him a few more questions, so take it away, Shane. Hey, guys. <laughs> how you doing? So, uh, like um, Moose said... My name's Shane Gorell. I'm originally from Washington State. Um, I was inspired to do this bicycle ride uh, for a weight loss journey. And uh, uh, I, in 2006, I was in a bad injury and I injured my knees and my back and my neck. And um, so I had a, a permanent whiplash in my neck, uh, sprained my back and uh, got really bad arthritis and deep bone bruises on my knees. My right knee has a torn ACL, a deep bone bruise, and a torn meniscus. And my left knee, I had a total knee replacement. So I, uh, I, I looked towards a, a raw plant-based living foods for uh, nourishment and regeneration of the cells and to help build the muscle tissue around my knees so I could lose weight uh, regenerate my cells and detox my body and uh, so I, I turned to cycling uh, because it's really physically demanding uh, very difficult to uh, for someone my size to just jump on a bike and go and uh, excuse me and uh, <laughs> so I, uh, I picked Sedona Arizona because uh, the guy that inspired me the most, Dan McDonald, he's known on YouTube as a life regenerator or DTM, Dan the man. And mm -hmm. uh, uh, he's a really famous raw foodist, but I've been watching his videos for years. And uh, watching his videos, I've learned that, uh, that green juice can actually uh, rebuild the tissue and it will regenerate your, your cells quickly. And uh, all I have to do is flush the toxins out and uh, uh, green juice. So uh, my normally gr normal green juice is a lemon ginger blast, which is uh, like kale, spinach, ginger root, cucumber. Cucumber is a superfood. Uh, ginger root is really good for inflammation for like my knees and takes pain away. And then I add celery, which helps make you limber. And uh, it's, uh, also uh, cilantro and habanero pepper. And so I drink uh, three or four 24 ounces a day. Uh, and in one 20 ounce drink, there's uh, approximately 26 grams of plant-based protein. So I get plenty of protein and uh, I just, I have a lot of energy. And I've been uh, green juicing for 58 days so far. Mm. Uh, but the last 44 days, uh, I cycled 1,028 miles and lost 78 pounds. Wow, and that's amazing. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, so my next step is going to uh, Los Angeles. I'm going to meet up with Lou Corona, and he's a world-renowned uh, raw foodist. He's been a raw foodist for 40 years. And I'm going to meet, meet up with Dare Dubian in Venice Beach uh, at her home, and we're going to do a, a juice video. Um, I'm also going to meet up with Mimi Kirk and uh, Lisa Mules and David Gaynor, which David mm -hmm. Gaynor is uh, Luke Roma's nephew. And David Gaynor, he cured a testicular tumor in 104 days with uh, raw living foods, which is the green juice. Mm -hmm. He also did a 10 day watermelon fast and then uh, enzymes, plant-based enzymes, which you can find at puredime.com. Right, I'll put a link to that too. Okay. With the video. Okay, and then uh, so, uh, I was really inspired by um, all these uh, raw food. It's been been raw for you know 30, 40 years, and I thought, wow, they look so healthy. They look so young and fit, and 
Lou Koronik and Stan on his hands, and, <laughs> you know, and he, you know, he's like 68 years old. So, um, so I thought, wow, you know, this is really going to work for me. So I jumped on the bike and I got a permit to ride along I-5 through Oregon and California. Wow. And I cycled over uh, Mount Shasta. Uh, I turned on to 505 heading west towards uh, the Bay Area. Mm -hmm. And I rode through San Francisco and then down the hill to Santa, towards Santa Cruz. And then I jumped on the Highway, highway 1, nice. zigzag <laughs> through the highway. Yeah. And uh, ended up here in Ventura. I wanted mm -hmm. to see my cousin. <laughs> and uh, so um, I'm, you know, just doing the bicycle ride has, mm. has changed my attitude. Uh, it's changed uh, so many different things about me. Uh, my clarity, I, I can think more clearly. Um, mm -hmm. My vision, uh, the colors are brighter. Yeah. Uh, my anxiety is gone. I feel more calm and collective. Mm -hmm. And I just, you know, love everything. I love life. Yeah, the juicing's been like cleaning out the toxins and and when we do that it cleans out the mind and the body and everything right that's right yeah and um i had a question what was i going to ask you um you're uh shane you're going to be well shane's taking you know pictures and videos and he's posting them on his youtube and um, i'll put a link to, to his youtube too and um what are your plans when you get to S sedona uh when i get actually when i'm Riding across the desert, when I reach Quartzsite, Arizona, I'm taking the hi Highway 10. So I'm, uh, if you follow me on uh, my Facebook group, which is Shane Eat Raw, you'll know where I am exactly what the day I'm there. And if you want to ride with me on the from Quartzsite to Sedona, I, I'm letting anybody want to come along ride. And mm. uh, so far, there are several people. Uh, there's uh, people from Australia that are coming. Wow. Uh, people from Los Angeles coming and people drive them from Sedona to meet up with me in Corsite to ride back with me. So um, once I reach Sedona, I'll meet up with Dan McDonald, the library generator. Um, I'm yet to meet him and I've been watching his videos for you know, probably like five years. And oh, cool. uh, so he said he'd meet me if, if I rode to Sedona. Cool. And uh, so once I get there, um, I will probably uh, end up riding my bike back because I don't. You know, really, you're gonna ride your bike back? Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh! Yeah. <laughs> I thought you might fly back or you know something like that. Well, who knows? It's an adventure. You don't know where you're gonna go. Yeah. You know where you're gonna go. Take it's, one day at a time. Exactly. Live in the moment. Exactly. And um, you might document your journey in maybe a book or a documentary, right, or That's something right. like that. I, I might. Okay, that'll be cool. So, is there anything else you want to tell uh, the Moo Tubers? Yeah, the Moo Tubers. <laughs> the Moo Tubers. Yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> um, well, I, you know, I really want to. Uh, when I'm finished, I, w I would like to help other people see what I see. So, mm. uh, I want to coach people. Uh, probably either work in a juice bar or own one at some point. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, and just and try and inspire people with what I've done. That's great. Yeah, I'll be there for him. That's awesome. Yeah. Okay, um, YouTubers, thanks for watching. And um, yes, go ahead, Shane. Uh, another another link where you can find me is puredime.com mm -hmm. backslash Shane Gorell. So it's P U R Y D M E dot com backslash S H A N E G O R R E L L. Yeah, and I'll, like I said, I'll post a link um, down below this video, or a couple links, so you can uh, su subscribe to Shane's uh, YouTube or Facebook or whatever. And um, so until next time, peace and blessings, everyone. All the best. Bye.